Good morning, dear students. We saw Shylock was very adamant in taking a pound of flesh, and he gives reasons why he is adamant in taking a pound of flesh. So he agrees towards the end that he has a deep-seated hatred and a disliking towards Antonio that he is following this losing suit against him. Bassanio. This is no answer, thou unfeeling man, to excuse the current of thy cruelty. So Bassanio is becoming angry and he is telling, you are a feelingless man and this is not a proper answer to be given. And to excuse, you are trying to excuse the course of your cruelty. Thy means your. Current means course. Or path, path of your cruelty. Shylock. I am not bound to please thee with my answers. I am not bound. I have not made an agreement with you that I should please you with my answers. Bassanio. Do all men kill the things they do not love? So Bassanio is asking him if anybody, uh, anyone would kill the thing they do not like or love. Shailat. Do men not want to kill the things they hate? Don't the men need... Um, Will they not kill a person who or a thing they hate? Bassanio. A first offense cannot bestow such hatred. So, for the first offense or a mistake, a sin committed against someone will not be reaching up to such a level of hatred. That's what he is telling. Shylock, what? Wouldst thou have a serpent sting thee twice? So since Bassanio told for the first offense, people will not be killing them. So Shylock says that, will you allow us? Serpent means snake. Snake to bite you twice. Sting means bite. The you bite you twice. Antonio, I pray you, think. You argue with a stone. So here Bassanio was arguing with the with Shylock for his hard-heartedness, cruelty, that he is going to take one pound of flesh from his friend, which would cause death for him. So, Bassanio was arguing with the Shylock, but Antonio stops him saying that, I pray you, I beg you, think you argue with a stone. Remember that you are arguing with a stony-hearted person. You may as well go stand upon the beach. You may go to a beach means the seashore. You may go to the seashore and bid the high tide bait its usual height. Bid means do not allow, do not permit the tide to rise very high, for the waves to rise very high. Bait means to moderate, moderate its usual height. Not allow the waves to rise so high. You may as well Use question with the wolf. You may uh, start questioning a wolf. Why he had killed the lamb and made the Eve cry. Eve is the mother sheep. Why the wolf had killed the lamb and made the mother cry. Make no more offers. Use no further means. You don't make any offer to him. Nor use any other means to save him. Save Antonio. But with all brief and plain efficiency. With all the, uh, the, in a plain manner or with the, in a brief manner, let me have judgment and the Jew his will. Let me have the last judgment that they are going to pronounce and let the Jew have his will. Bazanio to Shylock. For thy 3,000 ducats, here is 6. So Bassanio is offering him 6,000 ducats now. Shylock, if every ducat in 6,000 ducats, so every ducat, every one ducat in 6,000 ducats, were in 6 parts, that means each ducat is, is equal to 6 ducats. And every part a ducat, I would not draw them. I will not go away from my bond. I will not cancel my bond. I would have my bond. Duke, 
how shall thou hope for mercy rendering none so how can you uh, expect for mercy when you yourself do not offer mercy for others shailak what judgment shall i dread dread means fear what judgment should i fear doing no wrong i have not done any wrong thing why should i fear of judgment you have acquired many a purchased slave you have uh, many slaves whom you have purchased bought which like your donkeys and your dogs and mules you just bought these slaves just like the donkeys dogs or mules mules are small smaller kind of donkeys you use in abject and in slavish roles abject means in the in the menial works menial works which a normally a human being would not do you make use of them such a menial jobs and slavish roles because you bought them because uh, the slave belongs to you and slave uh, is bought by you the pound of flesh which i demand of him is dearly bought just like you purchase a slave and behave with them as you want now the pound of flesh is bought dearly bought from him it is mine and i'll have it if you deny me fear upon the law and if you are denying this pound of flesh shame upon the law fear means shame there is no force in the decrees of venice so there is no force in the decrees of venice can stand against taking a pound of flesh because there is a bond signed by antonio answer shall i have it please give me the answer can i have this pound of flesh so here he is giving the argument of slaves that are bought and you use them as you want now he claims that he has bought the pound of flesh with 3000 ducats so therefore he says he will make use of it as he wants